Hi everyone and welcome to Coco for Disney. If you're new here, I am Coco and as you all know who uh, have been watching, I am Coco for Disney. <laughs> Um, I collect all kinds of um, Disney items. I love Disney, love going to the Disney parks, love hearing about Disney, follow a lot of content creators on YouTube regarding Disney because I'm Coco for it. Um, today, um, we are going to discuss or show, I'm going to show you some Loungefly bags. Now, if you're not familiar with Loungefly, it's a um, grade of bags, a, a backpacks, crossbodies that come out by a company called Loungefly. My favorite series that they make are the fandom that they make are the Disney bags. Um, I have quite a few. You can see a couple of them in the background and we'll talk about some of those a little later. But Loungefly um, just recently came out with a series called the Princess Sequin backpacks, bags. So I was very interested in that. Um, I'm sorry to say that I missed out on the very first one, which was Cinderella in her blue ball gown. Uh, that was what the bag was um, um, made after was her um, bag. Now, if I had watched a YouTube channel called Mickey's Girls, which is on every second and Tuesday, I'm sorry, every second and fourth Tuesday of every month. Um, it is a group of ladies who are hardcore collectors. They know what they're looking at. They know how to value the bags. They know what bags to buy. And they're just a lot of fun to watch. They show their bags that they're carrying. They um, critique the bags that are coming out by Loungefly. And a lot of times I will go by what they critique and how they critique the bag as what I'm gonna buy next. I did miss out on the Cinderella. Like I said, they had they had promoted it, they showed it, they said when it was coming out and I missed it. So I don't miss Mickey's Girls if I don't have to. So make sure you um, subscribe to that channel, get on, check them out. A lot of fun to watch. Uh, make sure you're ready to sit down for a couple of hours because it is a lot of fun. So uh, let's get into the bags. Like I said, I missed the very first one, which was Cinderella but I got that second one. That second one was an important one. And Loungefly has just been putting them out um, here lately. <laughs> I don't know how I'm gonna keep up, but I did get this first one because it is my youngest daughter's favorite. She is hardcore Little Mermaid. So let me show you the bag, it is gorgeous. Again, it is the Little Mermaid. And she is gorgeous. If I can show you right up front, see those sequins, how they shine. So this part of the bag is not sequined. It, it, it portrays her fin, her green fin. They have the bow, look at that Disney plaque. And look at the bow. Each side of the bow looks like two adjoining seashells. And then in the middle, you have flounder. Isn't that just beautiful? You do have the side pockets on this bag. And again, that thin pattern carries over with the plain black, um, green background. Look at that darker purple zipper with the silver hardware. Look at that shine. So this is just a partial sequin, not a full sequin bag, which I love. Here's the other side pocket. And look at the zipper pull. It is a dingle hopper. Just adorable. The front pocket does zip around. Open. Is a pretty deep pocket there. It has that lining I'm going to show you here in a minute. But again, the sides, the straps carry on into that deep dark purple again. They are padded. You see your little Disney princess tag there. 
And then look at this magic on the back. <laughs> Under the sea. We do have those purple, lighter purple extenders. Oh, but she just sparkles. Again, I'm not a sequence bag, but this is gorgeous. And yes, I do want to collect the ones that uh, my family or my girls or that I like to have. I'm going to show you the inside of this. Inside, this is a better view on this side. Inside, you do have um, Ariel's tail and you have flounder. Isn't that pretty? Again, the purple. You do not have an inside zipper, but you do have that separate, separated uh, gusset pocket right there, which is nice to have. I like the zipper pocket, but I, I like the gusseted pocket as well because it's easy to reach into. But isn't she beautiful? This is the Little Mermaid Princess Sequin Lounge Fly. I believe this one now is sold out. Lounge Fly Miss Cinderella, so if there's others out there that are wanting this bag, I know it's probably a limited series, and but man, people missing out on this. Just beautiful. So if you can bring it back, that'd be great. But oh, just so pretty. So I got that bag. So then I made sure I was watching Mickey Girls, Mickey's Girls, and uh, they announced that the Moana the uh, Aurora bag was going to be next, but they were also show, showing the Moana. So we didn't know for sure in the beginning whether Aurora was going to come out. And Aurora, of course, is my princess, or if Moana was going to come out. This made it hard because um, my oldest daughter, her princess is Moana. So it just so happened that Moana was the one that came out next. Ooh, this is her open here. Right on the noise. I really loved Moana when they showed her because she's just so different, just like Moana is. <laughs> the plastic kind of hides the sequins a little bit. But I think out of the bags I have so far. She is so beautiful and different. Um, this bag has a number of textiles and textures to it. Um, this bottom pocket is cut out and look at that gold glitter on the bottom. Look at the little flowers from Moana's dress. While the Little Mermaid has the fin of Ariel and the little seashells as her top, this is Moana's dress that she um, wears through the majority of the movie. Um, you do have that Disney plaque in the beautiful orange. And look at her bow. There is the heart of Tafiti right there. And then the bow is a burlap, which has a lot of textures of um, beach, the weaving of the baskets that you see a lot. Look at these that are, um, these are kind of, uh, those are stitched. That is embroidery, those, those figures that look like seas or seashells right there. But look at the glitter in that as you come up. Look at the gold glitter. It does have the side pockets with the yellow trim that goes into the zipper. So pretty, and look at this little zipper charm, zipper pull. It's Moana's oar, just so cute. But look at that, isn't that beautiful? You have the gold hardware on this one. I love that yellow, the light yellow with that beautiful orange. Really makes me love the color orange a lot. You do have this front zipper pocket with that or zipper pull. And again, quite a bit of room in there. You can set quite a few things. My whole hand would fit in there. 
again, those zipper pockets. And then you have turned to the back and you have those light yellow padded back straps with the orange extender going into that or, uh, yellow again. And then look at the back. Follow the stars. Isn't that what Maui tells her? I don't know if it's her grandmother or Tala tells her that as well, or if it's Maui. You do have your Princess Disney tag attached to that. Your yellow loop, hole, um, loop handle at the top. Again, that beautiful orange sequin. And let's get in and see what's in here. Pull, a good Let's pull this out so I can show you the lining a lot better than I have been. Wow. Oh. Isn't that beautiful? Her oars are crossing on there. You see the Wayfair boat. Again, you on the other side, you do have the inside gusseted pocket, not the zipper pocket, but again, just nice to have a pocket in there. And again, that same print. That same print is on the inside of this pocket as well. Outside pocket. A gorgeous bag, just something very different. Again, a lot of textiles and texture in this bag. Cutouts, flowers, bows, that heart of Tafiti, that little pop of green on this bag with the yellow and the orange and the browns. Just different, just so pretty. Just so characteristic of Moana, right? So, Little Mermaid is my youngest daughter's princess. Moana is my oldest daughter's princess. And you know what? Lounge Fly couldn't give me a break. The next bag that came out was Aurora. <laughs> Three in a row. Three in a row. And you know, my granddaughter, we're trying to push her towards Cinderella. She's got that blonde hair, blue eyes, but you know, she's gonna choose her own princess. Thank goodness. I may have missed her, but um, we'll see. Um, so my next purchase since Aurora was the next bag coming out. And Aurora is my princess that I love. I haven't got to touch this bag. I did, <laughs> sorry, I couldn't wait. I had to peek in the box and take the paper off, but I have not touched her. So you have to give me a moment to enjoy this bag. Um, mm. I'm so excited. I love Aurora. I love pink. I'm an aged woman that loves pink. <laughs> oh. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this was a this was a surprise. I didn't think I was gonna get her. Um, my daughter had gotten online. Um, I was at work, so I couldn't get online when they were selling it and I don't know how fast she sold out. I think all these bags sold out within a few days. I think Moana may still be online, but look at her. That's her pink dress. Wouldn't it be wonderful if they could make a blue one too? Of course that's Cinderella too, so I don't want to take away from Cinderella, but isn't she just oh, any pink lover's dream now? Look at that Disney plaque. Beautiful pink with a light pink trim. I've got the bow, I haven't even got to touch her yet. So her tiara is on the bow, that famous tiara. Her pink, so that is a really soft material. I'm not quite sure what that's made out of. It kind of feels like a sateen, um, but rubber at the same time. There's that outside pocket. Let's see what hers is. It is her bag charm. Her zipper charm is the spinning wheel. Oh, and again, look at that pink trim. The gold hardware. 
again there are those side pockets the sequin pocket with the light pink trim on the side that deep pink with the light trim on the bottom another side pocket here come to the back and you have the pink light pink padded strap with the pink loop handle and then once upon a dream probably my favorite song out of all the Disney songs just such a beautiful love song I have to fix your bow come down a little bit there I'm gonna open this front zipper pocket Again, the same size pocket as the other two bags I've just shown you. There is the inside. I'll show you better from the inside. <sighs> She's so pretty. <laughs> I collect Aurora bags, so that was one of the reasons I did want to do the sequin bags. I knew she was going to be gorgeous, but then when I saw that my daughter's princesses were also coming out, I had to do it. And I do like the sequin bags. It's just I like to buy the character bags too, but these sequin bags, you can't pass these up. They're gorgeous. And so different. And so much the character and the way the um, princesses dress. Okay, so this is a a little bit more difficult to see than the other bags because it's a lighter print. But that is the spinning wheel. See that very well? Just beautiful and the roses and her crown. Just so pretty. Again, on the other side, the same lining with the gusseted pocket once again in there. <laughs> Sorry, I just love Aurora so much and I love pink and um, she's just a lot of sparkle going on there. So if I have one sequin bag, uh, it's going to be her and this is it. Just absolutely beautiful. So that is, that, are, that is the three uh, princess sequin bags that I had from Lounge Fly. Again, back to back. Little Mermaid, or uh, Cinderella came out. I just found out about that. Missed her. Little Mermaid came out. Mermaid came out. Um, they said to get on there. Got her right away. Then next, right after that, was Moana. And then right after that was Aurora. Now, my daughter-in-law <laughs> loves Belle. So guess which bag is coming out next? Bell. <laughs> At least we think so. There's a rose. They give you a clue. Um, again, go on Mickey's Girls or you can also get on loungefly.com on their Instagram and they show, uh, it's like a big bookcase and it's um, showing the shadows and silhouettes of each bag. They give you a clue, which is kind of fun as to what the next bag coming out is gonna be. We saw the rose and the roses that are associated with either Aurora or with Belle, so it's gotta be Belle since Aurora's out. The um, Aurora showed a crown, I think Moana may have shown an oar, and I think the Little Mermaid showed a shell. I can't remember, I have to go back and see all the videos and the Instagrams, but as you can see in my background, kinda giving a hint to who I think the next bag's gonna be, only my luck that I'm gonna have to get four in a row of course, that's not saying that there aren't any other princesses that I might want. So I would also, I think T T um, Tiana is going to be a really big draw for me. Um, there's so many princesses I love. Milan is going to be gorgeous. There's going to be so many princesses in that series that come out that I can't wait to see how they design them, how they add the sequins in. So make sure that you get on Mickey's Girls watch their channel and see what's coming out next. These bags are just amazing and a lot of fun. Lounge Fly, you do such a great job at um, getting these, these bags out and having the characters. Again, I do love the characters cosplay bags, but when you do this with sequins to these bags, you'll leave me no choice. <laughs> So I hope you enjoyed the content. I hope you enjoyed seeing these sequin lounge flies and I hope you 
um, will research them and you're interested interested in looking at them. There's so many lounge flies out there that are fun. Um, so make sure you um, research, get on Instagram, get on YouTube and watch and see the bags that you may be interested in. If you did like the content of, of what I just showed you today, please make sure you press that like button. And if you want to see more videos, um, which I'm hoping there are more coming, um, please press that subscribe button. Um, you can press no the notification button if you want to see um, when a video is coming out. I have been trying to put out one once a week. Um, every now and then I'll get maybe once one in every two weeks and maybe not get another one for two weeks at a time. So um, again, thank you for being here. I hope you enjoyed it. I love doing this. Um, it's a lot of fun. I love watching um, a lot of the Disney YouTubers. Please make sure to um, watch their channels as well. Um, a lot of fun. The great community out there. Love them all. There isn't one that I don't like or enjoy. But again, thank you for being here. And I hope you have um, a wonderful and safe day, week, month. And as they say in the Disney parks, have a magical day. Thank you. You chose Moana? Oh, the mermaid? Which other one? Oh, or the Aurora. Yeah, you like bye. that? Yeah, bye. You like that one? That's the one you're gonna take. Okay.